Frame fam, welcome back to the channel for another video. Today we are going to discuss the new rumors floating around about the RTX 3060 Ti that Nvidia supposedly has lying in wait for AMD to make their next move before being announced. As always, nothing is true until it is, so hold off on official expectations until a reveal happens and take everything I'm about to say with a grain of salt. That being said, insiders are saying that the RTX 3060 Ti is Nvidia's answer to AMD's reveal coming on October 28th, where they will announce several of their upcoming RDNA 2 GPUs, which is said to supply as much as double the video memory compared to Nvidia's current mid-tier GPUs that they will directly compete against with similar prices. As more time passes and rumors continue to spread, I can actually see TI models happening as insiders say Nvidia really doesn't want to lose the VRAM game, especially because many are actually expecting it to happen. And that is what has led recent rumors hinting towards TI models of the 3060, 3070, and 3080 having more VRAM than their base models to counter this possibility from AMD, and has led to a lot of talk recently about Nvidia launching the RTX 3060 Ti later this month, shortly after the RTX 3070, to disrupt AMD's hype. The question is here though, how much VRAM and extra horsepower will the RTX 3060 Ti variant receive, and what will it be priced? Well so far it has been said that the RTX 3060 Ti will have 4864 CUDA cores, 152 Tensor cores, and 38RT cores, with 8GB of GDDR6 VRAM running on a 256-bit memory bus with a 14 gigabit per second memory clock speed, providing a total of 448 gb a second of memory bandwidth. For comparison, this would place the RTX 3060 Ti at about 80% faster than the current RTX 2070 and about 20% slower than the upcoming RTX 3070, assuming of course that the clock speeds are similar to the 3070. As for cost, there's not much being said specifically, but insiders have said in the past that the price gaps in between the currently announced Ampere GPUs are to leave room for Ti variants in the future. For example, the 3080 Ti will sit between the 3080 and the 3090 for a rumored around $900. The 3070 Ti will wedge itself in between the 3070 and the 3080 for $600, and if those speculations are true and the trend continues to move downward, keeping the rumors of a base RTX 3060 model launching sometime in November for as low as $300 in mind, it's possible the RTX 3060 Ti could cost about $400 to continue the pricing sequence insiders have said we will see down to the very entry-level Ampere your GPUs, such as even the RTX 3050. But this is where you guys come in, and I want to know what you all think about this. Do you think the 3060 Ti will launch later in October and be a very capable GPU for the rumored price points to disrupt AMD, or do you think that there's more to all this? Let me know your opinions and thoughts down below in the comments, and I'll be sure to engage with you all. That's all I have to share with you guys today, and as always, it's been my pleasure. Please stay safe, stay happy, and keep on gaming.